So what brings you out this evening for Marisol Nichols Regard Cares event? Uh, well, I've um, had the privilege of actually shooting with Regard before. Um, so I, I know a lot of the people here and, uh, you know, they're, they're a great magazine and they're out, you know, supporting a great organization, a great cause um, that, you know, I think often like gets overlooked in like modern day and um, it's really awesome for them to, you know, be bringing awareness for it. And kind of talking about modern day as well, Modern Family is now wrapping up. Yeah. It's the, it's well, the end. We still got a while. Like, everyone keeps saying, like, it's coming to an end. I'm like, yeah. But, and, like, in my mind, I'm like, I still have three or four solid months of work ahead of me. <laughs> and it's like, yeah, it's coming to an end, but, like, I gotta get up at 5 a.m. tomorrow. So, no, nah, it's not it's not done yet. So, it still hasn't set in yet that it's oh, yeah. completely over. You know, there, 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 there are moments where it hits. Like, I was on set with um, Rico today. We were just sitting down in our, like, chairs waiting to go on set. And I just had, like, this, like, it hit me where I was like, man, and like, this time next year we won't be here. Which is crazy because we always are for the last 11 years. Um, so there are moments of like surrealism, but... And having grown up on the show, do you feel that it's going to be weird for you to transition into other things that you don't have that established family that you've known since you were a child? Um, I don't know. I, I, like, if there is a preparation for anything in the world, it's growing up on a TV show. I feel like once you grow up, you know, you don't go to high school, you don't go to any school, and you just, like, you grow up in that, that weird world. The modern family's been great, but it's still a weird world, world to grow up in, so, um, I, if I can do that, I, I think I'll be okay with anything I end up in. And because Lucas had so many amazing moments on the show, looking back and kind of reminiscing, do you have any personal favorites? Yeah, I, my favorite moment for Luke was, um, there's an episode where, uh, baby Joe gets christened, and, um, Phil basically orchestrates a Godfather like sequence um, where Luke is like wreaking uh, like uh, wreaking havoc and I just had a lot of fun shooting that when I was 13 years old. Oh, that's absolutely incredible. Thank you so much for talking with us.